In this episode, you will add new structures to Excel cells and change a few structure display settings. Launch JChem for Excel and select the JChem tab. To make sure that structures will be added with the default display settings, open the JChem for Excel options dialog and click Restore Defaults. Now hit the Add Edit button, which opens the Marvin Sketch Editor, embedded in JChem for Excel. Here you can draw a structure manually in the standalone Marvin Sketch application, or to save time, import a structure by its traditional name. For instance, use Lozartan. After pressing OK, the structure will be displayed in the Excel cell with the standard CPK coloring. If the default structure size looks too small, you can enlarge it by dragging the right side of the column and the bottom side of the row. I can visualize the structures not only in Marvin's sketch, but also can use the editor pane, which is useful when dealing with hundreds of structures on the sheet, and you would like to investigate them one by one. If you make a small change on your original molecule, it will be reflected in the Excel cell after closing the editor pane. By double-clicking on the cell with the structure, you can edit it with Marvin Sketch as well. Now if you would like to change a few display settings, for example, or don't need any colouring in the molecule, or you would like to see all hydrogen atoms on my structure and add numbering to all atoms, you can open options again, select the structure display menu on the left side, and change the colour scheme option from the default CPK to monochrome. The implicit hydrogens option from on hetero or terminal setting to all and the atom numbers option from off to atom numbers. After pressing OK, the coloring is removed, hydrogens are added and numbering is displayed on all atoms in the molecule. If there are multiple structures on the Excel sheet, these display changes will be applied to all of them. Now, restore defaults again and all your display settings will be changed back to their default state and these will be applied on all structures on the sheet. This video is about adding new structures to Excel cells with the embedded Marvin Sketch application and changing a few structure display settings. Thank you for watching. For more tutorial videos and updates from Chemaxon, stay tuned and subscribe to our YouTube channel.